Hey kids! Welcome to ICC Nairobi. We're glad that you guys are here. Hey, the Lord has something special that He wants to speak to each and every one of you. So let's turn our listening ears on and really be aware and receptive to what the Lord wants to speak to us today. God bless you guys and have a great service.
Hey guys, happy new month and the theme of this month is the 10 commandments and today we're going to be learning about the first four commandments. So God wanted to give his people rules that they can learn how to live with each other and how to live with him. So he called up Moses to the Mount Sinai and gave him two tablets with the 10 commandments. Now these commandments aren't just, you know, rules that we follow. It's all about learning how to live peacefully with ourselves and with God. The first commandment is to put God first. God is more important than anyone or anything in our lives. So he loves us deeply. He loves us so much. And we must express our love to him by considering him in all our decisions, praying to him, spending time with him. No matter how old you are, it's always important to put God first. Commandment number two, you shall have no other God before me. God is very powerful and he is God alone. Therefore, he cannot be represented by any statue or any image. Commandment number three, shall not use the name of God in vain. The name of God is very powerful and should be honored. You shouldn't use it carelessly or to curse people. But sadly, a lot of people just use the name of God carelessly, but we should not conform to that pattern. Commandment number four, remember the Sabbath day and keep it holy. God commands us to take the Sabbath day to rest just like he did after he finished creating the world. So on Sundays, you should go to church and rest. So guys, we've learned about the first four commandments. This teaches us how to relate with God. Now, it's time for the memory verse. 2 Peter chapter 1 verse 21, it says, For prophecy never had its origin in the human will, but men spoke from God as they were carried along by the Holy Spirit. Let's say it again. Second Peter chapter 1 verse 21, it says, For prophecy never had its origin in the human will, but men spoke from God as they were carried along by the Holy Spirit. Hope you guys have caught that memory bus. Try to remind yourself over the week. Now it's time for Money for Jesus. Ask your guardian or your parent to help you out in giving money for Jesus. So guys, I hope you remember the four first commandments. You shall have no other God but me. You shall not make any images or idols for yourselves. You shall not use God's name in vain and keep the Sabbath day holy.